I guess I think I'm done from here. Done everything I need to do. I came back to this old neighborhood of mine, which I used to love because it's really quite here compared to other places of Paris. A Chinese community usually tend to be quiet and respectable. This is really one of the less busy places in Paris. Ah, what we have here. Maybe I want to buy something to take away. I don't know. Ça c'est du code de cochon, c'est ça Ok, celui-là ah, C'est combien euh... Ok, je prends celui de 3 s'il vous plaît. Euh, oui, vous le poulet. Il y a du canard Canard. Ça Ouais, petit s'il vous plaît. Ah, c'est tout. Euh, je prends aussi un petit pour, pour euh, porc qui est ici, s'il vous plaît. Ouais. All right, guys, just spent 100 euros on Chinese food. Look at the neighborhood, guys. I mean, uh, these buildings really are so, are so high to look at, but this is where the community lives. But inside, it's pretty nice, actually. So if you ever come to Paris, you want to visit Chinatown, it's in, the, if I'm not mistaken, the 13th district. Uh, and that's where you're going to get all the Chinese food, Chinese restaurant, uh, Chinese community. Oh, they open the gym. That's pretty new. I mean, let me show you guys the building. It doesn't really look that great from here. Okay, check it out. I'll zoom in a bit so you can check. Right. 
Heading back to the station. But tonight I'm going to train. If you guys didn't know, uh, I used to do kickboxing uh, back in 2009. So when I'm in Paris, I do go train Muay Thai, which is very similar to kickboxing, just different rules. So that's why I'm heading back now. Because I got training around 5.30. She pretty chilly today. Ooh. Oh my goodness, it's freezing. I don't even know which station I need to get. Okay, let me check. 